Okay, the one thing I love about having the whole house to myself and being home alone is that I can record and I can talk to you guys and not even worry about Harry hearing me and I can set up and plan a very mischievous prank. So while Harry's out walking the dogs, I thought I'd make the most of this time because obviously I wanna be able to talk and speak with you guys like actually like proper about this prank. This is like the fourth time I've tried to pull off this period prank. I've done it in the shower, I've done it in bed and I've done it in public. And I thought why not do it in the car because these period pranks, you guys like love them so much. And I thought I'd like try and do a few more different ones. I'm gonna put the camera down here because it's really like heavy. See, the thing is with these period pranks is that I find them quite easy to do compared to other pranks because it's like very real life. And I think by saying I've had like a really bad period accident, it's something that would happen in real life. So it's quite easy to catch Harry out with. So like, that's why I feel like I can do it like a few times to get his reaction. This is the only time I don't know if he will clock on because like it's the fourth time of me doing it. But then again, it's a real life problem. So I think he'll fall for it, RNH family. We're planning on going out to Ikea later on because we're gonna do like a little revamp of our house. Like not fully, but we're gonna like add a few bits to our bedroom and a few buy a few plants and stuff. So I thought like on the way back after we've been to Ikea, then like I'll kind of somehow put like fake blood on my legs and stuff because I'm wearing shorts. So I'm gonna put some fake blood between my legs somehow at some point. I'm not 100% sure. I think I'm gonna try and do it while I'm in the car while Harry's like maybe putting the stuff in the back of the car or I don't know. I might try and get back to the car before him. I don't know. I'm kind of just rambling because I haven't fully thought it out now but now is like the time I have to do the intro. It's gonna be a bit stressful but we'll pull it off. Team Rosie pranks, we always pull them off, we always catch Harry out. So before we carry on with the rest of the video, I wanna give a huge shout out to Kieran Edwards, Naomi Gordon, and Katie Rose. A huge shout out to all of you guys that comment under our videos every single time. I want you guys to comment the word shock because I reckon Harry's gonna be in shock with this scenario, especially because it's gonna be in our new car as well, like on new seats. And I hope the blood's not gonna stain the seats in our car. So yeah, comment the word shock, spam it, you guys know what to do, and I guess I'll see See you when we are in ikea okay guys so we've just arrived at ikea and this is our second trip to ikea yeah. in this week and it's probably not going to be the last one either no we're, we're, we're obsessed with ikea at the moment yeah we are literally at ikea it's our new home yeah like, <laughs> I, I swear we're here so much now but like this happens all the time when we go somewhere that we really like mm -hmm. we then go Every so day. that's what we did with the Trafford Centre in Manchester. Now we've oh not been God. there for like We rinsed months. that so much. We were there every day. You guys know that. Who follow <laughs> us for ages. We were at the Trafford Centre every single day. I know. It was so bad. But anyway, we're back at Ikea. Second time this week. We've seen some inspo videos on Instagram and TikTok for a few things that we want to do to our house. Yeah. So we're going to pick up a few different things and like obviously just take you guys with us. And... Get some mirrors. Yeah. We're going to get, get some, some plants. Guys, we're going for a bit of like an interior design yeah, like rosie's are. teaching me the ways of being interior design yeah you're coming up with some good ideas i'm coming up with some good ideas like we're getting some more greenery in our house mm -hmm. it's yeah, looking more modern it's looking good it's looking good right yeah i like it but we're gonna get some more stuff today and yeah. obviously we'll show you guys what we get all right guys we've been in ikea <laughs> for about 30 minutes and all we've got is a plant that makes a change it does. i feel like if you come to this shop you either get the whole shop or nothing at all so we need to get some more stuff the thing about ikea is if you want one thing or you come in here for one thing you have to walk through the whole place yeah. to get one thing so where's the mirrors down here are they down there yeah. i think they're literally i can see them yeah we do oh the butt ones I like oh. these ones just here. Mm. Get the old tape out. This is essential. Like dad moment, right? Yeah, this is a dad moment, right? Okay. You can be it the dad. Be like 40. Oh, oh, bang on! Look at that. So this, is, this is when you know you're getting older and you get excited <laughs> over this kind of stuff. Okay, and then we said what? 160 centimeters. No, we said 65. I think. 160. You wanna hold it? Then? Right. This is 165. I swear, this is like meant to be. This is 150. Oh, that's this good enough. I reckon that'll do. I reckon that'll do. Do you reckon this jacket's for sale? That is a bit of me. Oh, shoehorn. What is that? Oh, they've taped it in. What is this? Don't tell me you never know, you don't know what that is. I don't know what it is. I'm guaranteed everyone watching right now knows what that is. You don't know what that is? No idea what that is. It helps you put your shoes on. You put it in the bottom of your shoe like that, and it... Have you not... I've never seen that. You're lying. We need to get this. I'm telling you, it'll be the biggest hack. It'll be like the biggest help you ever do I've with your feet. I've never seen that before in my life. Oh, have you never seen that? How much is it? Undo your shoe right now. And I'm going to show you how to use this because okay, I I can't I'm literally in shock that you've never seen one of these. Never seen 
<laughs> put your foot in, just put your foot like as much in as you can, right? And then put this in there like that, yeah. right? And now just... Oh. <laughs> That's clever! How cool is that? Hacks with Harry. That's what it is. <laughs> Harry's, hacks. Harry's hacks. I'm going to take you here for dinner. £1.50. £1.50? Tomato and mozzarella pasta. Don't tell me I never treat you. No, We're going for Ikea lot. dinner. <laughs> Do you know what we're going to choose? What, a plant? Yeah. Um, a big one, right? To go in our bedroom? Yeah. I think we're gonna. I think we should put something like that. I don't know if you guys can see. So sadly, we've decided we think we're gonna get a fake plant for our bedroom. But it's not sad because they look really real. They look really, really real in IKEA. Like that, you can't even really tell that that's a fake plant. The thing is, though, our dogs they love to eat all of our plants. <laughs> the dirt, like the and leaves. And especially in our bedroom, like they sleep in our bedroom at night. And I know in the middle of the night we'll just see Daisy chewing at the soil. Yeah, and this just it's just like a lot less hassle. So we might get one of these for our bedroom instead. That looks sick. I like it that. It actually does. I'm so excited to show you guys where we're gonna put these mirrors because we're gonna put them, I know it sounds really weird, but we're gonna put them behind our bedside tables next to our bed. The, what, the mirrors? Why would they crack? Because they're like on top of each other. Oh, that looks fine. Look fine? I'm gonna set the trolley back. Okay, all right. Uh... Game time, our H family. My fake blood in my bag next to me. I was waiting for Harry to go and take the trolley back. Right, I'm gonna put you guys there. Okay, I've got this fake plant. I need to be really, really quick. I'm just gonna spray it on the inside of my like thighs. Oh my god, I don't want it to get on the seat because I'm like Harry's very protective over our car. Okay, this is what we're working with. I'm just gonna like leave it like that. Okay, put the camera back. Just continue to like speak. Oh my god, I'm nervous. I'm just. Gonna, I think I might just go straight in with it. I might just go straight in with the fact that I've got my periods leaked. Bugs, my periods. I've got my period. Have you what now? It's come out of my, my trousers. Nah. It's staining my legs. I need some. Let me come around. Hold some on. Some tissues. Hold on. Yeah, I got. Hold on. I'm just starting my period. It's like that's a like well, soaked down. That's a have... weird color. How? Why is it like drooping from there though? It's come through all through my um thingies. Yeah. Have you not got a blood. um? Have you not got a pad or anything? No, I, I, didn't, I didn't know that I was going to be on my period. Have you got any wipes? It's like staining. It's like staining. You. Are you recording it? Mm, I don't think so. I just put the camera down. Oh, it is still filming. Hold on, let me turn it off. Well, you're pranking me. No. Is this a prank or not? No, of course it's not. You sure? Of course it's not. I've just got my period. I've said to you all day my cramps have been Is bad. it like, is it all inside your, um, yeah, it's your all pants in, as well? Yeah, so I, I don't know. I need to, sort of get, need to get home maybe. Okay, uh... Is it okay? It looks fine, I just don't know why it's staining you. Why is it staining you? Because it's blood, isn't it? Right, then we're going to put these in the bin, okay? Okay. You okay? You feeling okay? I think I just got bad cramps. I Love didn't you. expect to come on my period, that's all. That's alright, don't panic. We'll go and get you some, um... Get you some, I'll get you some pads, yeah? Where from? Do you want me to get them for you? Because you can't go out, can you? Yeah, I can't go out now. I've got blood all over my pants. <laughs> right, I'll go and... <laughs> we'll find somewhere. Hold okay, on. Okay, thank you. Oh my god. Was that believable? Just to put... I've got stains all over my legs. Look. Oh my god. I don't know if that blood looks believable, but he's just going to put the tissues in the bin. Oh, he's over there. Okay, no stress. He's going to put the tissues in the bin. Bless him. He literally like wiped all the blood up for me. <laughs> I don't know if he believed that. The fact that he questioned it was a prank, I'm not sure. But let me. I think we're going to go to the shop and get some tampons. I think he's going to get me. So let me try and pick up the camera then and then break it to him that it was a prank. Okay. Oh god, that's really bad light. Okay, you can see him. We've just came to Tesco and he I've told Harry to go and get me some pads. He said he asked me what ones to get, and I just said, get like a couple different sizes of pads and then like some tampons. But I didn't tell him the specific of sizes, so like I don't know what size he's gonna get me. So that's gonna be fun. Let's see if he gets me like the biggest pads ever. <laughs> and then obviously, like he needed to get some stuff for dinner tonight, so he's getting that as well. But I think it's gone well. He did ask if it was a prank, so I'm not sure if he's clocked on. But I'm gonna, when he starts walking back to the car, I'm gonna just start filming him and just like bring up the fact like that it was a prank and just laugh and see what he says. Um, but yeah, I think it's gone well so far. Hey, yeah. Hey, you okay? Yeah. Why is that facing me? It's not, it's just sat in my lap. Come on. What? Is it recording? No. Sure? No, what did you get? Okay. 
we've got you some pads. Mm -hmm. I know you <coughs> I know you use them ones. Yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Why are you smiling? <laughs> Show me the camera. What? I thought you were recording. I'm not. Let me see it. Yeah, you are recording. What are you doing? Don't tell me this is a prank. It's not. What did you get me? Are you just recording what I got you? Yeah, I'm just like doing a little haul. Like a a little broccoli. Te a little Tesco haul. <laughs> got you some organic broccoli for dinner. Yeah. And I got you these uh -huh. uh, pads. I didn't know which ones you wanted, but they, they look uh, like yeah. the same. The num the like the number five extra They're night yellow. secure. Yeah, like the the biggest the biggest ones on the scale. How am I supposed to know that? Are they the biggest ones? No, you're so cute. How have I managed to get you again, huh? <laughs> have you actually got me again? Yeah. You're lying. No. No way. Do you think that blood looked real? No, I didn't. That's why I was That's so That's why you questioned it. Did, so did you think this... Have I got you? Or like... We, did you think yeah, that this you was a prank? Yeah, you have got me, yeah. I have. But I, did, I thought it was a prank. And then I asked you and then you took the camera off. So I, I assumed it wasn't. Yeah, I, so I turned sneaky. it off, right? <laughs> this is like the fourth time you've done this. I can't believe I actually got you. I give up. I honestly get, you I got, got me. Pads. You got me the biggest pads you could ever get me, so that's nice and secure. And they're the right tampons, well, to I'm be gonna, fair. I'll use these ones then. No, I actually will use them at night time, just in case, at some point, yeah. We can share. I can't <laughs> believe you got me. That's so. You're so silly. You're so cute. How do you do that? I, it's like one of the easiest pranks to do, because you can't turn around and, like, tell me I'm being fake, can you? Because, like, no. you have to kind of help me. You do them so well. <laughs> I can't believe you. What the hell? You're so sneaky. Team Rosie. You get me every single time. I, every time you have a period now, yeah. and there's a camera, I'm going to know it's a prank. <laughs> I swear I'm I think that's it now for the period pranks. I don't think you're, I can You're going to have to do, do some, anymore. like, you're going to have to, like, do one that's extreme for, to get me next. Yeah, I know. Like, I didn't know if I was going to be able to pull this off. I literally said earlier, I was like, I don't know if this will work because this is like the fourth time I've done it. But it is. The, the I'm, that's time. it now. I can't do any more period pranks ever because you're, you're so going to catch me out. <laughs> you're so sneaky. What the hell? <laughs> but our H family, if you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and the subscribe button. Yeah, but Team like Rosie it. got no, Harry don't again. Don't put Team Rosie in the comments. Put Harry is the best boyfriend. Yes, put Harry. Harry's the best boyfriend and Rosie's the best at pranking in this relationship. I don't know. Do you know what? At this point, like this, you, okay, you're the best at these pranks. I'm the best you at have, all pranks. This is the best, like, this has almost become a series now. I know, like, Team the Rosie. The period oh, prank, yeah, that. The period prank series has literally begun. Like, it literally is. But guys, if you like this video, make sure you hit our subscribe <laughs> button and the like button and I guess we'll see you in another video. And I, I am never falling for this again. <laughs> never. Peace. Peace.